Hello and welcome to our presentation of our most recent workflow. This application is based on an enzyme immunoassay, which contains multiple standard liquids, two controls, a start and a stop solution and requires more than 300 steps by the robot, including multiple changes of the tools. Before our buddy starts the workflow, a few visual controls are done to proof the readiness of the application. In this video you can see us checking if all necessary objects for the application are present in a given scene. First a customized faster RCNN object detection algorithm that was trained on hundreds of images is used to identify possible objects and their respective location. To check for missing tips inside the tip rack, another neural network was trained to visually detect the center position of the four corner tips. The other positions are then interpolated based on these detections. This approach is not only precise, but also robust to many changes in the scene like rotation or lighting. Using additional computer vision techniques, all final locations will be compared to check for anomalies. The potentially missing tips are then provided to the user. After a successful object detection, our buddy starts his work by grabbing the pipette and aspirates the predefined volume from the standards. The order and wells in which the liquids are dispensed are predefined by the user. The pipette is directly connected to our buddy via a Bluetooth connection and can be controlled, just like a human would do. After completing the first liquid handling steps, Buddy changes the pipette for a microplate gripper to cover the liquids. We have integrated a mixer from Q Instruments that is also controlled by Buddy and mixes the liquids before keeping them at a steady temperature for incubation. We have skipped the incubation process for demonstration purpose and continue with Buddy taking off the lid before placing the microplate into the washer on the right side of the picture. There is no digital connection to the washer, therefore Buddy uses its tool to press the respective button on the device to start the washing process. After washing is completed, the second pipetting block can start. The microplate gets taken out of the washer and is placed back onto the mixer before Buddy switches back to the pipette. Now sit back and enjoy watching Buddy doing the rest of the workflow until it's done. The complete workflow takes around 40 minutes to complete. And if you are wondering, what happens now? We are currently working on implementing a reader to get the results of our test and send them to the electronic lab notebook.